not maybe about the best sailing performance in just every second, but it's uh, about staying concentrated and keeping up your mind for a long time. He was searching for someone to do this adventure with him that was prepared for it and not too heavy. <laughs> I think we both love the sailing those fast boats that are fun to sail. Well, it's the ultimate challenge uh, to finish uh, uh, I fly uh, Great Britain tour of four weeks, not going back with the ferry, but to sail, to sail home. In about 10 to 15 minutes, we're going to the water to leave Stokes Bay Sailing Club into the direction of the starting line. And probably at 5 a.m., we will start. Yes. We crossed the starting line at 5:26 a.m., but there was just no wind, and we had to stay very calm to get to the starting line. Then uh, we got immediately on the foils, got a little bit out of the Zoland, but um, I mean, unfortunately the wind died quite uh, fast and uh, we had to stay calm to get out of the Zoland against the current with no wind. We tried to spend as much time as possible on the foils, but it was not that easy. And then between Alderney Race and Jersey we really got back into a flying mode and we have been really fast so then we got back into game and thought okay now we have like five hours left and just a few miles we will do this for sure. The toughest challenge on this was for sure the end. Once the wind died again, it became more and more difficult. And then in the dark, it got more and more difficult because there was so much seagrass and we didn't see it in the dark anymore. So we hit a lot of seagrass during the night and the boat stopped. We had originally planned to be like 12 to 15 hours on the water and at this time we had been already nearly 20 hours sailing and we saw it in the last hours running away and had been quite tired and uh, this was really a bit frustrating but on the other hand like all over the crossing was so good we had such a good feeling about the boat and all and uh, yeah, for sure, we'll come, come back again and uh, with our experience now, especially with all these tidal um, stuff and all these currents, uh, we are pretty sure next time we'll be better and we start at the right moment, so we, we next time have to go with a better weather window or a longer standby period, so then we are pretty sure that we can get it. <laughs>